boy, it's a wordy word problem. What are we dealing with? We have a vending machine coin box. It contains nickels, dimes, and quarters. And what? The coin box contains five times as many nickels and six times as many quarters as it does dimes. If the box contains a total of $138.75, how many of each kind does it contain? So what we do, we defined our D to be dimes, our N to be nickels, and our Q to be quarters. What's next? We're looking for the relationship between nickels and dimes. Now, y'all told me that there were five times as many nickels as there were dimes. So which one gets the multiple of five, the N or the D? The D gets the multiple of five, because whatever dimes is, multiply it by five, and that's the number of nickels. What's next? Quarters. All right. So now we have the relationship between quarters. Okay, calm down, because we're actually recording this right now. Which one gets the multiple on that, the quarter or the dime? The dime. The, the dime gets the multiple because there's more quarters. There's six times. There's six times. Six times as many quarters as dimes. So that one gets the six. So now me and my math got this relationship. It's the dimes plus the quarters plus the nickels is going to be 300 and 138.75, but you're telling me that there's weight to these. Weight. We need to put out how much each cost. So a dime is 0.1, a nickel is 0 0.05, and a quarter is 0.25. Yeah. Now we make our substitutions. We put in our N and we put in our Q, where our N and our Q was. That's what you saw here and here. So wait. What's more? We continue to multiply those through. That 0 0.05 and that 5 make 0.25. And similarly, I have 1.5. That's my quarters. So then I add all those together, combine my like terms. I'm going to divide by that multiple. I find out that I have 75 dimes. Now what do I do? I got to go and I got to put those back into our relationships. So, on our nickels, that's 5 times 75. We have 375 nickels. My quarters, that's 6 times 75. So, wow, that's a lot of quarters. That, you imagine how heavy that is? Oh, my God.